Welcome to Car of the Month by Gaslens UK. I've been asked to take the mantle and uh, show off the entries, and I'll be doing the videos from now on. Colin Havard has put in the money for the prizes, so he's basically taking over and sponsoring this month's prize pool. So you'll be winning money directly from his pockets. Let's jump right in. Bart Van Schaik turned this Hero City Sunday truck into this uh, pizza delivery, pizza slicer uh, turret mounted van. Then we have Benjamin Pop who turned this uh, Atherium truck, uh, looks like a Mars rover kind of truck with uh, the door opening on the side there. It's got uh, cracked windows, really nice rust job on it. We got Braden Watchell who turned this lobster cage into a food truck where you could get some uh, Martian Molotovs. It's got some nice details on the uh, roof there. Next we have Chris Johns to turn this uh, Barbie truck into the pie guy. Don't know what kind of meat's in there, but good luck. And uh, the door opens on the side. That's pretty cool. Very interesting. Next we got uh, Christoph Pyre and he's turned this truck into a ice cream truck or like a sweet tooth uh, from Twisted Metal kind of truck giving away free candy and uh, he, he dislikes Mars apparently and uh, we got Frank Saucian turned this uh, little van into a massive rig looking thing it has uh, it actually has six wheels and, uh, and it grinds up whatever it could find to put in your food next we got Gary Tasker turned this uh, Junior Cones ice cream truck into a uh, pretty cool tank looking thing elevated with the engine coming out of the uh, hood there that's pretty cool now we have Ian Bearham and he's done a pirate ship on wheels or flies that's pretty cool next we got Jay Conklin I love that green that was really nice uh, he's done a uh, alien spitting looking thing. Probably brought it back from uh, Mars, I guess. Next we have Keith Boisvert. And he turned a circus truck into a... Uh... Man, look at that ram in the front. That looks like it, it picks up people and holds them there. And then you could use them for meat. It's pretty, uh, pretty interesting. Kilgore MJ has turned this uh, stunt truck into a uh, giant meat barbecuing uh, rig that's really cool lots of work in there next we got mario pereira turned a uh, gold rush truck into a uh, another meat food truck with a menu and everything really cool and now we have math andrews turned the uh, ninja turtle truck into this uh, mad mex Probably Mexican food. Little guy there in the window, ready to serve. Nice job. Then we got Matt Reeves. Turned this uh, school bus looking thing into a... Uh, <laughs> chiller killer. That's a lot of... Uh, the rust is really nice. The little details are really cool. Next we have Matus Zager. And he's turned a paint truck into a food truck. You With scum soda and menu and everything really cool and uh, next we got michael mercy turned a police truck into a mr whippy soft ice cream serve and it's got a little catapult on top that can throw uh, ice cream so that's interesting probably not ice cream though and uh, we got nick kitch another ice cream truck turned into an octopus ink cone uh, for five bucks i'd buy that that looks uh, interesting the wheels aren't touching love it now we got Nick Woodruff turned this ice cream truck into a burger truck. <laughs> that massive burger there is awesome. Ohio will kill you. And uh, we got Paul Chapman Moss turned a Barbie truck into a thing of beauty. There's all kinds of guns coming out of this thing. It's, it's ready to lock and fire on you. And a nice little couch there too. We got Ricky Williams who turned this Ferrari into a traditional Italian pizza maker in the trunk. Really cool. Love the idea. It's not a truck. Super original. Rob Noir turned this bus into a nice, cozy 
trailer and uh man i'd eat there look how cozy that is pop a beer super cool tombo baxter turned this ice cream truck into a well meat gatherer i don't know if you want some meat chunks of meat in your ice cream but you could get it there tony peacock has turned a bunch of cars into this Whitby's fish and chips uh and that i i eat there sure why not zach steiner turned this fire truck into a new york pizza making truck uh complete with everything you need and including chefs and uh really nice job there but now it's time to announce the winners third second and first place i'm gonna pass over the mic to the judge who will announce the winners of this month so now we're down to third place and the winner of 10 pound and this is Matta Sega. I had planned on building an ice cream van myself and this is exactly like I'd build it. Lifted, armoured and with a big gun on top. Now if only you hadn't used the Lego chassis, we, you could have placed higher. But well done all round. So in second place and the winner of £30 is Nick Woodruff. This build is absolutely bonkers. The giant burger as a wrecking ball is truly inspirational and so well thought out especially on a little Citroen van, although I suspect a hazard roll would be required every time it swung, leading to the tipped over shed on the failed road. The weather in this and the signs as armour is very gasland, it's scary. All around a very solid build, which you can see on a table trying to negotiate its way around under gates. Well done, Nick. Hi, so in first place this month, I've chosen Matt Reeve. If I didn't know better, I would have said that James Hall built this creation. And every time I look at it, I find something interesting to see. The little teddy in the grill is absolutely amazing. The bank of loudspeakers are really cool. And the rocket lollies, lollies on the roof as missiles come to the mind of a madman with a 3D printer. Then you delve deeper and deeper and find the little chitty chitty bang bang, child catch child's poster at the back, and then the cherry on top is a menu board at the window. That's definitely a Gasland Uco logo in the corner I can see so let's ignore the sound board as a gimmick a funny one and all but all round a solid build right being too over the top so well done Matt you win first place so finally we have winner of the best newcomer prize somebody who hasn't entered the car the month before I couldn't decide on this one so easily so I decided to award the same prize to two winners and I do apologize beforehand but I'm about to butcher your names so the winners are £10 each is firstly Mario Pereira this thing is fierce and it just goes to show the skills and you know you come as a bring to the show my only gripe with this behemoth is where are the guns this is Gaslands we like guns and finally, and also joint winner of the best newcomer, is Keith Boisvert from Outlaw Speed Shop. I don't know invite, who invited you guys in, but I'm liking what I'm seeing. Stretching this little van is awesome, and your attention to detail is spot on. And we have guns. I really enjoyed the video you made for it as well. Now I know how to steal all your best ideas. Well, there you have it. The judge has spoken. The Car of the Month winners, congrats to all of you. And uh, again, this is my first time, so if you have any uh, suggestions, please let me know in the comments. And uh, if you do play Gaslands and you're looking for uh, dice or gates or uh, templates, even uh, some uh, modification items like, uh, I don't know, engines with skulls on them or guns or rams, pipes, uh, we actually sell a container with all of these items inside and you could go check out the etsy page we've also added some uh, flame effects and fire and stuff like that so all that is in the description and make sure to join us on facebook at gaslands tv we have uh, monthly giveaways and uh, a lot of cool discussions on that page so go check it out and we also do diecast racing where you could send in your own cars to uh, race against others thanks for watching see you next time